Coronary artery bypass grafting, or CABG, is a surgical procedure used to treat coronary artery disease, a condition caused by the buildup of cholesterol plaques in the coronary arteries of the heart. During the procedure, surgeons use arteries and veins harvested from other parts of the body to bypass the narrowed or blocked sections of the coronary arteries, thereby restoring an adequate blood supply to the heart. CABG surgery frequently involves harvesting blood vessels from the chest, arm, or leg to be used as conduits in the bypass, followed by joining them to the coronary arteries. The most common graft choices are the internal mammary or thoracic artery, the saphenous vein, and the radial artery. A sternotomy is a surgical incision made vertically down the middle of the chest, directly over the sternum or breastbone. The surgeon carefully divides the sternum to gain full access to the heart, lungs, and major blood vessels. Cardiopulmonary bypass. The pericardium, protective, fluid-filled sac, is open to gain direct access to the heart. The heart will be connected to a cardiopulmonary bypass machine, heart-lung machine. Cannulas, hollow tubes, will be inserted into the right atrium, small pumping chamber of the heart, and the aorta, the biggest artery of the body. These tubes will pump the blood into a machine that oxygenates and circulates it back into the body. Thanks to the heart-lung machine, the surgeon can stop the heart by injecting it with medication or a cold solution. The heart needs to be still to properly attach the vessels. Bypass grafting during CABG surgery, the internal mammary, thoracic artery, and saphenous vein graft are attached to the affected coronary arteries below the area of plaque buildup and blockage. Multiple blocked arteries can be bypassed during the same surgery. Usually, the left internal mammary, thoracic, artery is used to bypass blockages in the left coronary artery, while pieces of the saphenous vein are used to bypass the right coronary artery or other coronary vessels. Sternal closure. Once the grafts are in place, the surgeon will slowly take the heart off the cardiopulmonary bypass machine, heart-lung machine, to restore normal circulation to the heart and body. Sternal wires are placed starting from the top using surgical stainless steel sutures. Skin closure. The skin is closed with incisions. The scar will fade over time.